general in class we speak about a lot of topics, science, but uh, we open the debate, we speak about the different cultures, we speak about uh, um, the, the customers' uh, uh, habits, etc. because it's very important to understand uh, in which world we live and I think science is very good to, uh, to, to explain in which world we live. Um, it's uh, when we are uh, learning about uh, genetics and uh, um, all the, um, the chromosome movements and the genes movements during uh, uh, the process of reproduction. And uh, so before we were teaching that and, uh, with uh, diagrams and uh, we said, uh, look at the chromosomes, they are doing that and then they split, etc, etc, etc. But now um, I gave them um, um, uh, the result of a, a crossing and uh, they have to work together to find why we have this uh, this result. So at first they see the result and they say yes, it, it's easy and I say yes, show me a diagram, explain, tell me how it works and then the, the, the real problems comes and uh, they they, they speak together, they, they kind of fight sometimes. I don't agree with you, uh, I wouldn't do it like that. And after an hour and a half, you can see that they, they start to understand and to, uh, to uh, make diagrams that are quite good. And at the end, they did the lesson by, the, by their sem their themselves. And so uh, I'm quite confident that it's a good way to uh, make, uh, to help them to make their own knowledge. They need to be able to sing by themselves. They need to be able to watch television and say, okay, uh, I can understand they want to sell me something, but I can understand as well that there is, um, there is an, uh, an information that I need to well understand the process and to understand the consequences of, of, of uh, uh, of this stuff. So it's very important now because they are, it's a very technical world, science, a scientific world, but they need to be able to, to understand what's uh, behind. I met some other teachers from uh, all over Europe. I understood that we had the same issues, the same problems in class, but uh, I understood as well that uh, uh, in uh, many countries we found some solutions, some things that work at school, and uh, so I took some examples, I came back to my uh, school and I tried it to, with my students, for, for example, uh, inquiry-based learning. Uh, I wanted to do it, but I wasn't sure it would work, and, uh, and uh, after that I'm more confident to do it and uh, it, it changed uh, uh, a bit my uh, way of teaching and it's going to, be, to change ag again. This is uh, the future classroom for me, uh, a classroom where, where you can move, where you can um, do what you want at the moment as you, that you want it.